Okay, y'all, so I've ranted about Pokemon for, like, another 30 minutes now, and, like, we've looked fucking everywhere for this thing, and I can't... Hey, look, there it is! Fuck you. <laughs> so... <laughs> Alright, here it is. <laughs> mm. uh, it, was, it was out of the corner of your eye. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh, right, Ricky is still partially sick. Yeah, I'm still hacking up patriotic mucus. Election day, you know? That's nice. Plasma. Um, you wanna save that, put it in a jar? Yeah, well, it's just patriotic mucus. This It'll goes go to away. the Trump Clinton Foundation. <laughs> This goes to- no, th no, this should go straight into the voting ballot. You know, I really- I should research this, like, I think it popped up on Facebook, it was like, uh, why don't you, like, do some research on your candidates, like, who else- aside from the Green Party and the two major ones, uh, who else can you vote for? Oh, there are, like, a bunch of, like, independent- like, independent candidates. Like, remember what we saw, um, like- Oh yeah, the, the Green Party, or, oh the yeah, the- the three- the No, remember the guy, what was his name? Yeah. Um, like, uh, the guy who owned, like, all the- the tiger farm? Yeah, that, oh my god, there were some... I realized now, it was like, oh, we do have other options. Oh, they're Joe also... Wild or something. Oh, good, they're also nutbags. <laughs> Isn't that great? I feel like it's like a requirement. If you run for president, you have to be pretty fucking crazy. And I think, what was it, like, Dr... I think, what was her name? Dr. something? Uh, Jill Stein. I think she was actually... She did... She spoke in Birmingham not too long ago. She did. And I think, what was it, her thing was that she had some good plans going on, but it was like she didn't really quite understand how... We will, I'm gonna stop there, because I don't want to get too much into, like, Okay, so politics. go Mount Fuji, that's it. Okay. Okay, you can stop talking to Plasma now. I, I didn't read it, I'll spend another ten. I just told you, go Mount Fuji. Uh, I read it. The audience, I like they hearing can... Plasma. <laughs> a pipe maker in Mount Fuji should be able to increase your power. Okay, yes. so there's a pipe maker. Yep, that's exactly why. The same guy who made your chain pipe. Oh, fuck. Okay. Okay, come here, Green Ranger. We're gonna have to farm money later on in the game. We are. Actually, it's probably gonna be sooner than you might think, but... Mm. Well, we're gonna go Mount Fuji really quick, so go to the... Nope. Nope. The there coffee it is. shop. There you go. It's your Uber Dragon. That will be twelve fifty. Tips are appreciated. But See not the dragon. Yeah, apparently uh, I've uh, been working as an Uber driver for a little bit. Ah, oh, how, how's that going for you, buddy? <sighs> it's kind of fun. It's just it's not. A, it's not quite. What? Watch your flute. It's not quite enough to be really worth my time. Yep. <laughs> Unless you're in like a place where you know like you'll be... I don't know, some nights you get some good stuff, Was but... the pipe maker up at the top of Mount Fuji? Yeah, yeah, top of Mount Fuji. You gotta okay. go get to him. It's... Dun, dun, dun. Apparently, like... You get enough that it's kind of worth something, but it's not... They don't compensate for gas. That's one thing, and you, you're going the wrong way. Down here? That's enough. Yeah, down the bridge. Okay. So they don't compensate you for gas, which... Man, That's a I, big minus, and I've been there, man. Yeah, because, yeah, you've had a job like that, and it's... It's kind of been a philosophy for me. It's like, if you're spending gas to make money for the company you work for, they should be compensating you for that gas. That's a business expense. Yep. I don't know, maybe I'm fucking super liberal like that, but I think that's a proper thing to do. Well, if anything, with if, if Uber's running this the way I think that they are... Was just similar to how uh, they were running things on uh, Liberty National, which was what I was working for, Liberty National Life Insurance Company. Um, oh, you're just you're wanting to just go ahead and say that? Uh, fuck those guys. <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, excuse me, here, Ric Ricardo. Um, I have a recording of you on a YouTube show. You said, <laughs> "Fuck those guys." <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Like, I appreciate everything that I learned from there, but. And their and their business is legitimate. It's just and I've like looked at this throughout most of like freaking throughout most of freaking like uh, the reviews of like how a lot of Liberty National places run. It's pretty it's pretty sketchy. Well, yeah, like they do shit to try and minimize um, expenses. It's yeah, a lot of. But then you know, there's a lot of businesses that go a little bit too and far. And I do blame. I don't blame the specific agency. I do. I blame specifically the business itself, like the corp, the corporate, 
because like before I would like I I before I worked out deals of like where I would work part time for these guys while I was studying for an exam for a huge like for the GRE. And uh, they agree, and the guy who I worked for agreed to like pay me a set amount. Uh, and well, they usually start you off with a set amount, and then they go commissions, right? No, like before, and these these agents like it's one hundred percent commission. But when I was like working for part time, which I was just making calls for them and setting up appointments and like hiring people for them, uh, they would pay me like a set. Of, they would pay me like Whoa. a set amount. And that's what he agreed to, and he was like fine with that. But then corporate told him was like, no, you can't be doing that. You gotta like make him like work for it. you. Gotta like uh, when he you can you can only pay him when he actually. Oh no, like yeah, I know how that works. Like I'm looking a little bit. Of, I'm. It's funny because I'm actually trying to get in the marketing, even though it's like <laughs> those are usually where the biggest assholes are. Yep. Or it's like according to the charts here, um, people really. I don't know, we make a little bit more money if we d don't pay our employees more, and then it's like, oh no, good, right. and then they don't so think the guy, about the consequences So the people that. who I worked for, like, they were legitimately good people, and I feel like that, it was just a circumstance, like, they like what they're doing, but, like, with the way corporate was running it is, like, well, yeah, cause getting really sketchy, and they're just, like, having to follow their own, like, uh, like, follow their own, like, f follow what people, like, what their higher-ups tell them to do. Well, I mean, I've had this, I mean, I'm not going to say the company I work for, but I had this issue with a um, certain company. They're like, oh, we really want to get our, like, rewards cards out there. And they're like, well, it's a very essential. You call it a rewards card and they save money and it's great. And I really looked at what it was. It's like, this is a credit card. <laughs> and yep. then I noticed, like, um, some of the employees who are really good selling them, mm -hmm. whenever there was, like, a customer who was kind of, like, old... Or maybe they were like kind of I don't know like English wasn't their first language. Mm -hmm. She would jump on those people. Yeah. Like the kind of people who wouldn't know what a credit card was. I'm like, yep. this mm -hmm. feels really fucking wrong. No right. And then the people who do were like, oh no thanks, you know I don't want another credit card, because they're smart. They know it's a credit card. And then when I say this, the manager's like, no no don't. It's not a credit card. It's a rewards card. Wink, wink. I was, I don't know, I was like, this can't be fucking legal. You can't just, like, not tell people this is a credit card. Alright, so it's the same. Here. Well, 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 long time no see. Hey, this is no coffee shop. Oh. <laughs> Did you just ask for coffee? What, what now? We Please come improve for a cup our of coffee. Oh. Okay. Stand back, I will show you my training variety done. I <laughs> Whoa! But yeah, I... I have knees of steel thanks to my new knee slapping abilities. Okay, so I got that improvement. Yeah, so now you have super weapons that do more damage. Weapons. It's only the basic weapons. Now it's a sacred sword. Thanks. Oh yeah, so check this out. So hold B with your sword. <laughs> so you can do a... Really impossible to do in real life. Oh, so now he has a better weapon too. They all do. Nice. Nice. Yep. And I think there's another level up you can get near the end of the game. But my sub, my shitty ass camera, my shitty ass bombs. Yeah, yeah, all of the weapons loot. are the same. So it's all the so, basic weapons. Yep. Alright, so now we gotta go back to Snow Mountain. Yeah. But it's like. Hang on, well. Well, no, nothing, on the, nothing on the people who I worked for, because who I worked for, and the uh, guys who I worked with. They were really great people. It's just I just really didn't like how things were being ran there. Yeah, because it, it's really easy to stray that path where it's like, whoa! Like when we we're doing it's like we we're getting a lot of like good results and good money, and it's really hard to be in that kind of path and not stop and think about. Well, hold on one second. We're we might be doing something a little bit fucked up here. Hey, wait! Did no. I not go to a coffee shop? No, no, go up. No. I, I cannot go up. But, yep, yep, yep. but you went up there. Oh, oh there, there it is. There it is. Okay. Yeah. But no, like, I didn't even have those conversations, like, several times with the, like, with, that also shows, like, how cool the, the guy who I worked under with. When I actually have conversations about how, like, management is doing things, and, we, and it's not like he doesn't feel insulted or he never had a hint of like, oh, no, you're wrong or like, you need to shut your mouth kind of thing. Oh, he like had nice. an open conversation with me about this kind of stuff and 
I've, I've heard some stories of some really bad bosses who do that too, or just like, hey man, who the fuck do you think you are? You just started, I've been working here for 10 years, I know. Not through there. Not through there, oh yeah, that's right. No, but... But yeah, like so they, like, it they was... think they're the authority. Yeah, it was like, it was a great learning experience overall, it's just... I just was not happy working there because it just was not what I wanted to do. No, so. it's fun. But yeah, like I said, I had a similar experience. So and you know, it, and now we're both now we're both unemployed. And now we're both self. <laughs> hey, we're self-employed. Thank you. We're self-employed, making no money. Absolutely. Now I saw I saw our monetary things. We've made a whole thirty cents. <laughs> oh, good. I wasn't actually sure if we. I was like, I think my brother put out a good point. He was like, "Why do you guys even bother monetizing this? Just have it ad free for now." Eh, we can do what we can with it. Yeah, sure. People get ad block. I ain't gonna. I ain't against people using ad block. We use ad block. Yeah, we use ad block. All right, get to that rock. I Quit playing with ghosts. I want to smash some ghosts, man. Click. They got little flipper hands. They do. They're actually really adorable ghosts. I love them. I love every character design in But this you game. just love smashing everything. I do. Alright. Uh. Oh. <laughs> nice! <laughs> <laughs> That's the power of a level 2 hammer. Oh, and it just floats up in the air! Yep. Goodbye! That then it has like that awkward like camera movement where they're like trying to readjust it back. You see that a lot in like Ocarina of Time too, mm. where it's like after a cutscene, it's like, uh, okay, you're back. All right, so now you gotta climb up and go to the next All dude. All right, <laughs> with the main dude, character. We're, we're really getting close to like finishing this game. Well, I don't know. We're not getting that close. I see us actually finishing this game. We would get there if you'd stop and trying to kill everything every time you well, saw I something. I love to kill Ryan. You'll get some. I'll give you an opportunity to kill shit later. Oh, fine. Ebi Masar. Ebi Sun is the main character, and he has to kill everything in sight. As main Boop characters do. Oh, I think I saw an extra life down there. You can get on the way down. Yeah, but you know what? We're not wasting time, so. No, yeah, you just get on the way down. Gotta climb Mount Fear. Mount. Or as it would be called in America, the Devil's Mountain. The Devil's Mountain. Kids really love the Devil. Kids really love the Devil. Hello, I'm the Devil. I have a mountain and a coffee shop right next to it. They also love Mountain Dew. What can we make out of this? Mountain Devil, the new flavor mountain of Mountain Dew. Dew. We got Red Devil. Red so Devil. Edgy. Oh, that'd be great. Red Devil. <laughs> and it's just like a really good... And it's like a really like gross, like super sugary medicine type of flavor. Oh yeah, it would just be like you remember like code. What was it like the Halo gamer fuel? Oh yeah. The, apparently, my friend. I never had one, but my friend told me she's been here for 120 years. Oh, that's nice. There's something I can see. Something. What? what can you see? This is my fly open. Whoa! <laughs> Oh, there's laughter. I That's love it. not where I'm looking, looking silly. silly. Although I am now. I see an old man with a strange look. Very dark place. Does he, like, have his fly down intentionally just so, like, people can catch him with his fly down? Because Eddie's got a Is huge this some ass sort of dick. weird exe exhibitionism? With my powers, I can call him here. Here it really? comes. Really? Please. I just want to get a glimpse of my wise old man. I got your wise old man. Fuck. Okay, so, so we yeah. do have to farm. Yeah, so I was. I kept telling you, like, hold on, that money. You're gonna have to spend a bunch of it. <laughs> so we're probably gonna spend a lot of time off screen farming for money, which I know exactly where to do it too. Okay. All right. So, well, um, we can farm some here right now. I guess. Nah, not right here. No. no. Oh yeah. Slide we... down. Oh, this is cool. Nice little shortcut. All right. So what were you saying about like gamer fuel? I mean, it just it apparently tasted like fucking gummy bears, like <laughs> liquidized. Isn't that isn't that a lot of like fucking energy drinks and like Mountain Dew ish kind yeah, of thing? Yeah, but apparently this one more. It was like you can. You ever had a drink where you can just taste the sugar? 
Yes. Like, you actually... I don't know, it's one of those effects where you drink it and you can, like, immediately feel the effects because there's just so much. I remember there was this one thing that, like, it was, like, an energy drink mixed with Mountain Dew brand. Four loco, right? Uh, was it? It was, it, it was like, a legitimate soda. It was, like, this is, like, two times what's in Mountain Dew kind of thing. I don't know. The, what, like, Guarana? I don't remember. That's not really, like... Shit in the energy drinks that makes you crazy. All right, well, we're gonna farm money. All right. Well, tune in next time. We'll have three hundred bones. See ya. All right. Travel to um the first dungeon, Oedo Castle. Okay.